Just like bees navigate using sky polarization, we use the same phenomena of sky polarization to help the soldier navigate. Polarization is a very complex phenomena of light. It's difficult to sense. It's not available in commercial systems today. We use high power mathematics, um, onboard image processors, custom software, optical systems that are designed specifically to leverage this part of the light. It delivers information that has not been available for users today different customers, they have much of what they need in thermography, but what they don't have is that one little bit of information that helps them make decisions to be situationally aware, and polarization adds that value. We have discovered that our polarization sensors can find oil floating on water really well. And we have uh, been through a round of testing with the country's premier oil response test site. You could set up some of our cameras around an oil rig or uh, at a transfer point or along a pipeline and not have to man the surveillance equipment to make sure that you're not spilling anything. You could set it up to autonomously alarm when you get a spill. GPS denied environments are encountered more and more frequently in modern day battle space. And so any type of solution which can aid in navigation in these GPS denied environments is critical. So SkyPass is a sensor that can provide a navigation solution in these types of GPS denied scenarios. It uses the sky map essentially that's created from light that is reflected in the upper atmosphere off of small particles. Over the next 10 years, the systems and prototypes that we're developing today, they're going to become more mature and there's going to be manufacturing breakthroughs that will allow us to drop the cost. But today, we've developed systems that are field-ready prototypes so that we can develop the different applications for this new emerging technology, polarization sensing.